Hello everyone, welcome to another video. In this video, I will show you how you can scrape data from TikTok. Now, whether you want to scrape data from TikTok comments, from TikTok uh, you know, pages, from TikTok accounts, you can do this in a very, very easy way. Now, let me show you how. So, first of all, what you need to do is you need to go on Epify and sign up for free. You can sign up for free. This is basically a, a platform where you can install multiple different applications. Now, once you're on Epify, what you'll need is you'll need a tool that is easy enough to use, but complicated enough to scrape a website with a structure like TikToks because it's a very, very big order uh, in order to for you to go and in order for you to uh, try this. Now, as you can see, you can go to the TikTok scraper on Epify. So just find the TikTok scraper page, as you can see on Epify. Uh, if you go to epify.com slash clockworks slash TikTok scraper, here you will be able to see basically the, uh, you know, the page. So obviously this is just uh, one thing that you want to do. So you can try it for free. You can, by the way, you can try it for free. You can scrape it and then you can forget about it basically. But as you can see, you go to the TikTok scraper, you try it for free. Make sure to try it for free. You will be redirected to Epify console from there. If you don't have an Epify account yet, just sign up using your email. By the way, you can find this by also Googling TikTok scraper Epify and just click on that link. From there, just join. From there, as you can see, indicate TikTok video profile or hashtag to scrape. Now this is based on you, what you wanna scrape. So you can scrape hashtags, profiles, specific videos, or you can scrape search as well. Now, as you can see, obviously, depending on what you want to scrape here, you will have the input. So here is the input, for example, uh, you know, for, uh, you know, hashtags. And as you can see, you have maximum post per hashtag. You can enter the post and save and start. Once you save and start, you will be able to go here and you will be able to uh, search for that. Now, as you can see here, you have hashtags here, you have profiles. And then you also have profiles or video URLs and hashtags. So you can add multiple URLs or bulk edit them as well. So that's basically how you can scrape data from TikTok. It's very efficient, very easy. This is the only app I know that is this efficient. So definitely check it out. And yeah, we'll see you in the next video.